If you have ever wondered what the rarest and most expensive skins are in Counter-Strike, today's video is for you. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the 5 rarest items that exist in Counter-Strike in 2021. The total combined value is almost $750,000, and most of these skins have a pretty cool backstory. A special thanks to Draps, at Draps underscore on Twitter, for helping me out with this video and gathering the information which I am showing you guys today. Obviously, if you like skins, check out my website websites which I'm sponsoring my own videos with. My websites are designed for you to get free skins, so on BetRefs you're able to get all the affiliate codes for free and you're able to join a daily free giveaway. If you put BetRefs.com in your Steam name, you'll get triple entries on that giveaway. And on Skinaways, we simply list all of the active giveaways currently in the CSGO scene on one page so you can always find all of the active giveaways. We're going to be working down to the rarer skin. So starting off with the least rare skin on today's list is the Statrak Karambit Crimson Web with the pattern 59. Pattern 59 shows the cleanest webbing on the play side and this skin being Statrak Factory New obviously adds to the max rarity. This is also a one of one item which means no other skins like this exist. It's currently owned by Lord and his Steam bio says nothing for sale. So he actually decides the price. The current price estimates around $30,000. But as this item is a one of one and Lord is the only person to own it, he actually decides the price of this item. The next item on the list is a Souvenir Ob Dragonlore with four Titan Hollows. This is actually a duped skin, but the one with the four Titan Hollows on it is the original one. The duped Souvenir Dragonlore does not have four Titan Hollows on it, but just one. The other stickers is a Cloud9 Foil Cologne 2014, a NIP Foil Cologne 2014, and a ESL1 Cologne 2014. The float isn't too crazy, it's 0.042 obviously factory new. The op is currently owned by someone Chinese named Lord Bell. Fun fact, this op was dropped during the quarterfinal match between Cloud9 and NIP in 2014. The estimated price for this op is around $100,000. The next item on the list is a M4A4 HAL Statrak Factory New with a 0.003 float and 4 i by power hollows on it. 0.003 for the Statrak M4A4 HAL is the lowest float available. Non Statrak, however, there is a 0.0021 available, but obviously Statrak is more valuable than non Statrak. There's also an M4A4 HAL with a 0.007 float and 4 ABBA powers on it, owned by QKSS, but that skin's actually banned. In a future video, we'll take a look at QKSS's inventory because he has a lot of expensive stuff that's all banned. Back to the HAL we're looking at right now, this one got sold for $75,000 about three years ago so the current day price is around a hundred thousand dollars this haul is currently owned by someone named alex the next item we're taking a look at is the Statrek Minimal Wear AK Case Harden on a 661 pattern with four Titan Hollows. The best float on an AK Case Harden Statrak Minimal Wear is 0.09, but this one's actually in QKSS's inventory, which is banned. The one we're looking at right now has a float value of 0.11. This AK was previously owned by Batman. He sold it to Lucas for $150,000 in January of 2021. Lucas now lands out this AK to the pro player Dupree. They want to win the half with the 8-7. And to do so, their money, it's been whittled down. God, if it's a 2014 Titan sticker, that one's worth a bit, huh? Someone was telling me that, that Dupree's operating with an expensive AK. Was that you? Yeah, it was. I saw some people um, nerding out over the specifics of his case hardened. It's a blue, uh, blue gem, you know, the float, a unique float that makes yep. it all blue. Okay. And it's Titan Hollow's... 2014 edition it's it, it's it's a massive flex like he's walking in like bejeweled bedazzled covered in diamonds gucci slides the ak in this pattern being stat track with four titan hollows applied to it is easily worth over hundred and fifty thousand dollars. before we get on to the last most rare item in today's video i'm going to show you two fun extra items so this stat track bowie knife crimson web factory new in a 0.068 float got unboxed in 2021 there's an unboxing video of this knife i'll link it in the description and i'll play it here for you guys this case sucks why did i pick it if you get a knife you're you're literally gonna get like a a Bowie cum knife. Bow real forest, yeah. If you get something like that. Motherfucker! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Come on, bro! Look at that! Look at this shit, bro! 
Anyway, this knife is worth around five to five and a half thousand dollars in cash. The next item we're looking at is a case hardened AK in a 661 pattern as well, aka the best pattern in the world. And this one has the lowest float in the world as well, and it was crafted in a trade up. So this one is non stat track. So let's say there is a stat track factory new AK case hardened, and then in a 661 pattern with four Titan hollows on it, dude. I'll be here until that happens. The previously best AK case hardened was owned by Max Skillet, but obviously he won't be reclaiming the number one spot. So onto the rarest item in Counter-Strike, we're looking at a Karambit case hardened factory new with a 387 pattern. The 387 pattern is full blue and this Karambit being factory new 387 is the only one in the world. This exact knife sold for $135,000 in items about 4 years ago, and it hasn't been sold since. There's a Twitter thread by MercyCS and he explains that back in 2017, there was a 387 pattern Karambit in a well-worn condition, valued at $10,000. Today, that is around $30,000, so that's triple the price. If we consider the fact that last time this Karambit in a factory new condition got sold for $135,000 4 years ago, right now it probably is worth around $400,000. But then again, there's only one of this Karambit in the world and it is by far the best item that exists. So if the user who owns it currently wants to sell it for half a million, a million, or two million, he can really demand any price until a new Karambit 387 factory new is unboxed. Obviously, those extreme prices are ridiculous, so the estimated value of this item is around $400,000. This Karambit factory new 387 is owned by someone who goes by the name Blue King, obviously a very fitting name, and I think he's a Chinese trader because I just translated whatever his Steam name is into English from Chinese. Anyways guys, that was it for today's video. We went over the top five most expensive or rarest items in CSGO. If you guys enjoyed, drop a like on the video, subscribe to my channel, or check out my websites if you want to support me in any way possible. Also, make sure to follow Drebs on Twitter. Without him, these videos are not possible, so show him some love. He really deserves it. If you guys have any video ideas, let me know in the comments down below. And with that said, I'll see you guys in the very next video. Peace.